head and find the integral for the following. Uh, we can actually break this up into a common integral form. So sine of x and then cosine on the bottom could be broken down to cosine of x. Cos cosine of x. So sine of x over cosine of x times 1 over cosine of x. Uh, th this is exactly what we have above. The reason I did this is this right here can be converted to tangent. So we have the integral of and then this is equal to secant. So I'll write secant of x, tangent of x. So I mean, you know, why would I even do that? Well, like I said, this is a common form. Uh, if you if you know it, uh, it's simple. It's just the integral of that is equal to secant of x. And then of course we've got our constant c, and that's it. Alright, I hope this helped you out. I appreciate you watching this video, and you have yourself a great day.